And welcome back everyone, it's me Picky Kemi here, welcome back to more Mutants Genetic Gladiators. Okay guys, so we're here because another limited offer of a mystery box is on sale for the Zoom... Z Zoom Morph? The, the Zoom Morph box? I always call it the Beast Geno, so Beast box as well. So it looks like you can get pretty good stuff from here. And as far as I'm aware, the first Geno... This box contains a Zoomorph Legendary Star Mutant. Give it a try and win a Silver or Gold Mutant. So this isn't necessarily the first Geno isn't going to be a Zoomorph or a Beast Geno. So this the Beast could be the last one because I had a comment. I don't know. It wasn't yesterday. I didn't record yesterday. The day before, um, two days ago, about someone called getting that werewolf thing and his geno begins with a necro geno followed by a beast so it's not necessarily a beast geno that you're going to get first again because of my main profile my picky gazer profile i have so many um mutants it's just not viable for me to spend gold on this but i like to and i definitely know you guys like to see what you can pull from these boxes with any sort of luck because these videos rate their socks off I'm so glad and so you like that content and I like giving you that content it's just I don't like getting shafted <laughs> as I would in my every time I've summoned, summoned on this if I was summoning in my picky gazza profile none of the mutants that I got that I've gotten so far have helped that profile at all none of them so this is why I summon on this one. It's it's a bit more useful and this being my personal account that I first played the game with. Uh, we've also got a couple of other things on sales just for a quick little update. You got the jackpot tokens. 400 gold I believe for 50 jackpot tokens. If you play the game often enough you shouldn't need to do that. Limited offer, the level up, the evolution center is on, sa on sale but it's only 50% off so that's quite low. Uh, that's quite bad, let's just say. Low and high isn't a good terminology. But that's quite bad. You want to go for it when it's around 70%, 70 to 80%. That's what I would recommend. So even if you can afford to upgrade, the only time I can recommend upgrading is if you're less than level 30. Get to that level 30, then you can do Platinum Mutants, and then wait till it goes on sale more. Just a little helpful tip there to all my fans. And we've got uh, missions available, guys, so make sure you grind out these missions. The first ones get to level 5, then you've got things like do 3 PvP battles, do 10 million or 10,000 damage, things like that. And you get challenge tokens throughout it. The challenge tokens can be used in here to purchase mutants, stars, things like that. And I don't know this for a fact, but I believe the new mutant is going to be available in the challenge hall. So it's going to be a mythological saber. I believe it's the next challenge hall mutant. Don't take my word for it, but that's what I believe. That's just not based on anything. Not based on anything. I've got my information from nowhere for that. Okay, so we'll get on with this video. And I'll probably use the whole 2,500 gold. I'm about to get more gold from here anyway. It's an hour and 10 minutes away. What's that? 100, 200, 300, 450 gold in two days. So, yeah, I'm not too worried. Okay, let's go. Let's see. What do we get first, guys? First summon. Boom. Kung Chow. I think that's the pig. With the moustache. Is it not Kung Chow? Let me just do a quick quick Google search. Kung Chow MGG. Mythological beast. Kung Chow. Kung Chow. Let's look it up, shall we? See it's first Geno is a mythological Geno, it's not a zoom off one. Uh, beast Kung Chow. So I actually have a standard version of him. This is what the Kung Chow is. So we pulled a silver one, which look, I'd rather not have pulled him. 
uh, but those are his stats as uh, Platinum Star, so you look at that. Again, as I do normally, the best mutant in my opinion is Gerard Steel Garden, so I compare him to Gerard Steel Garden. Gerard Steel Garden does 800 and something damage, and then another 800 and something damage in brackets, so he does more damage. Gerard Steel Garden's speed, is it 4 or about the same? But, oh, look, look, it's roughly the same, give or take 0.17. And Gerard Steel Garden's health, health is 5,000 standard, so it does more damage, um, more health, and uh, I have one here, I know I do, there we go. Let's look at your level 1 stat, so 984, 984, same speed, more health, so it's not, doesn't compete, so it's, it's not a great mutant now, it's actually quite an old mutant. So Kung Chow, we already had that one unfortunately, so... Let's see if we can be lucky again. I hate when I, I read the comments. I do read the comments, guys. I don't know what to reply to all of them because it's it's just... I record the videos at night time, upload them and release them at night time. I go straight to bed then, wake up, go to work, get home from work, either look after the kid and wife, spend some time with the wife, and then maybe have a day of not recording. But yeah, my day is just taken up. I can use my phone to read the comments, but it's just... I just, yeah, I forget, I forget sometimes. Like, I do read the comments, so I, I would like to reply to you more, but I'm just letting you know, I do read the comments. And some of the thing you guys pull... <sighs> ticks me off. <laughs> nah, nah, it's, it's fine, but I'm glad other people can pull good stuff here. Okay, let's go again. Leo Hearts. Oh, That's a Zodiac Mutant, is it not? Um, what's Leo Hart's Geno? I, I, I want to say Beast first. Let's, um, let me do a quick Google search. Leo Hart MGG. Yeah, it is the myth. It is, um, not mythological. It's, um, it is that one. So Beast and Space, is it, or Mythological? Where's Leo Hart? What's your Geno? Come on, mate. What's your Geno? And Sabre. Beast and Sabre. Leo Hart. Oh. Okay. Okay, so I have a standard version of Leo Hart. Not the star version. So look, that's actually a good pull. And let, let's look at his stats there. Now, again, again... These guys had a boost, but he still does not compete with Steel Garden. Same speed as Steel Garden. Steel Garden does more damage, pro almost double the amount of damage. Almost, just a bit under. And again, more health from Steel Garden. So this is, I, I, I sound like I'm repeating myself a lot, but you guys always ask me in the comments, you know, should I buy this? Should I buy that one? Should I buy this? If any of you have not got Steel Garden or Ergen, save your gold for them. Do not buy any other mutant but them. That, that, look, there are a few other mutants out there that you should buy. Um, uh, I can't think of them at the top of my head, but they do do good damage. There's not that many, but those are the main ones that I, I, I recommend. Um, you know, feel free, guys, to talk to each other in the comments if um, someone says, look, if someone comments, what are the other two mutants other than Ergen and Steel Garden that are good? G give them the tips down below and reply to them, guys. Even that helps me <laughs> sometimes. But, um, yeah, there are a few other. Not, not that many, but just a few other. But this one, again, doesn't compete with him, so I won't use him. But that's a, that's not a bad pull. I'm I'm actually I don't know if I've got a silver version of Leo Hart in my original profile. I may have to check for that. Now these boxes I thought they were 500, but they're 700 gold. So uh, this is going to be the last one, guys. So can we get lucky? Um. Sing. San, Sanik, 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 is that it? Sanik? I don't know, we've got, okay, Sanik, hopefully that's how you pronounce it, MGG, is that like Sonic, is that meant to be like a Sonic lookalike mutant, 
Beast and Saber. I don't think it's a great pool, looking at the picture of it. Uh, mythological, Beast and Saber. Oh, I don't have it. Surprise, surprise, I don't have it here. So that's the mutant. Um, you've got to look at the silhouette here, but it's it's a hedgehog. I, I think it's meant to be something to do with Sonic, even though it looks nothing like it. Let's look at the platinum version. <clears throat> they are god awful stats. They're awful stats. <laughs> so yeah, it's not a great mutant. I don't have it. So in, in this profile, so that's pretty good. Um, is it a way for me to log out into my other profile without closing it? I think there is. Let me. Um, it was mythological and beast was the first one. I can't remember its name. Quite. Let me log into my original pro, my my picky Gazza profile and see what if I've got those mutants. Okay, guys, we are now in my picky Gazza profile. Let's have a look. Mythological beast was the first one. I can't remember exactly what it was. Kung Chow. So I had Kung Chow in this one. Be useless. And then it was. These ones and a saber. So, um, Leo Heart. So I didn't have Leo Heart. So I missed out on pulling Leo Heart. Granted, I spent seven hundred gold. How much you can buy these from the shop now, can't you? Although, let's think of it logically. I did have to pull twice to get Leo Heart. So that's one thousand four hundred gold. Just FYI, and I did have the Sanic. Sanic the Hedgehog Mutant. That's a bit clearer picture of what it looks like, but yeah, that's god awful. So yeah, Leo Heart was the only good mutant I pulled. Let's um let's have a look at it in the shop. So Okay, look I, I could have saved a little bit. What was it? It was fourteen hundred, so 700 gold I could have saved technically if I pulled it on this profile, but I also did pull again and got two useless mutants, which is what seven months of seven seven twos fourteen seven twos twenty one. So okay, for what I spent, I spent two thousand one hundred gold on my other profile. I would have spent two thousand one hundred gold to get a zodiac mutants, a silver one. So they need. I personally think they need to reduce the cost on those by quite a bit, especially when you're. Uh, as deep in the game as I am and most other people are as well and like I'm not talking about the newbies but uh, most other people it's not worth pulling on it for newbies it is because you can get a lot of mutants that you don't have anyway guys that is it for this episode this quick summoning videos I know you guys like it so I hope you really do thank you guys for sharing the videos I do read the comments just so you know uh, so as usual lose my voice thank you so much for watching if you Feel free to leave a like on the video. If you want to go and help your boy Picky out just a little bit more, feel free to share this video on any social media platforms or forums as you see fit. Thank you so much for watching, guys. I'll see you all next time. Bye!